Hey guys, welcome back to Primetime Sports. Today we'll, we will be previewing and predicting the Camellia Bowl between the 6-6 six six Florida International Panthers out of Conference USA and the 7-5 and Arkansas State Red Wolves out of the Sun Belt. Interesting thing about this bowl, has no sponsor, it's just the Camellia Bowl. Both teams are very similar um, in terms of just the overall strength of their team. Would you like to dive into that a little bit? There? Yeah, Ned. to go across on that, to go on with that. Uh, they're both really closely ranked in the FPI. Arkansas 91, Florida International 99. Um, they both each played Power 5 teams this year. Um, Arkansas State obviously lost to Georgia earlier in the year. And then Florida International, they beat Miami. Now, Miami's not on the level of Georgia. Yeah, that's just true. So it's It was interesting to see Florida International pull off that upset. So, yeah. So you're saying like both teams have a decent strength of schedule. Like they've played known teams that – yeah. Are going that so you kind of like you kind of know what you're going to get out of these teams in your opinion. Mm-hmm. Um, interesting thing to watch in my opinion. This is the Florida national quarterback James Morgan. It is his final game at FIU. He's really good. Um, very good. Redshirt senior, I believe. Uh, he's been part of the program. I guess if you're redshirt senior, five no, years he, now. He, he actually started at Bowling Green. I think he transferred after one year from Bowling Green. Still, he yeah. So he's still been there for a while though. Um, so I think the team will definitely be motivated, or at least him in particular at the quarterback position will be motivated to be sent out on the right note. Uh, stats wise, he's thrown, I believe, 39 touchdowns in, his, in the two seasons, yeah, in the before, two seasons, before, yeah. 30, uh, 39 touchdowns. Um, the other thing is not only with quarterback play from FIU, but this Arkansas State defense isn't exactly the strongest unit in the world. So I could see James Morgan having a field day. They actually give up about 35 points a game, which is a lot, a lot. in college football, especially if you're like a, a bowl yards team. passing, too. A bowl team. Are you talking for, for Arkansas FIU? Arkansas State gives up 300 Oh, they give up, yeah. Game. So James Morgan, the offense will definitely run through him. Yeah, uh, he didn't miss last year's bowl game with an injury, so he'll probably want to go out there. And play. But, you know, it's a new year, and we're talking about this game. But, um... Storyline for me for Arkansas State is uh, I think they really just want to win this game for their coach, uh, Blake Anderson. You know how they started yeah, off the year with true. that. Um, his wife um, died of cancer, so mm. they probably want to win. Um, I don't Facts. know why you're laughing at that back there, cameraman. It's, just, it's not something to laugh about. Yeah, um, but laugh Arkansas about State, their key player, their best player is Omar Bayless. Um, he led the country in receiving through 12 games, the whole country. With 14 he ended up seven. not leading it at when it was all said and done. That Through 12 actually, games. That, that went team, to he, he didn't play 13. The LSU wide receiver, yeah, Jamar Chase. He actually, through the regular season, we'll put it that way, he led the, he didn't play a 13th game like um, Jamar Chase, but yeah. 1473 yards and 16 touchdowns. Um, expect him to have a really good game offensively. So both teams' offenses are very solid. They're both very similar in terms of how much they give up, in terms of how much they score, in terms of points per game. Uh, Florida Nationals defense just a little better. In my opinion, their quarterback I think is going to be a bit more riled up. And to be honest, like Arkansas State is a great wide receiver. I don't doubt that. But you need a quarterback that can get them the ball. And we'll see what the Arkansas State quarterback can do. I believe it's Lane Hatcher is his name. He's not exactly the... Um, a household name in a group of on a group of five team, but he's been efficient. He's kept the ball. They don't turn the ball over that much, and so that's yeah. Yeah, my prediction for this game: I'm gonna go Arkansas State. Um, I think they're just a more complete team, and the FIU has not won a game outside of their home, home field. Oh, so they have not won a road game. Or technically, they ha- or technically, they have. They just haven't won one outside of Miami. They beat okay. Miami on the road. Okay, but yeah. Haven't won and my, road. I mean, this isn't really a true road game. It's a neutral game, so I don't think that factors in as much. I'm going to go Florida National. I think they have a quarterback who's riled up and wants to play well in his last game. And Arkansas State's, de- de- Arkansas State's defense ranks 127th, I believe, out of 128th in total yeah. defense. So I'm going to go with Florida National in that one. Uh, come back. I believe we're doing the Las Vegas Bowl next Las between Vegas Boise Bowl. State and Washington. Chris Peterson's game. final game. Come back for that one. Peace. Peace.